In this video, you'll learn how you can export individual parts as audio files. Open Finale, and I'm going to pick this song here. First, we want to make sure that our settings are correct. For example, make sure that you're using Play Finale through audio units. It's tested. It will load the Garriton instruments, which are sample instruments and hopefully play them. Now, in class today a couple of people didn't get it to play. This can happen when the Garrington instruments are not loaded into the instrument slots as shown here. There are many possible reasons why they are empty. It's our job now to make sure the instruments get reassigned properly to their channels. So let's assume that they're not there. What you have to do is select the staff tool. I already have that selected. Go to new staves and create a new set of strings. So let's start with single strings. And see, I already made that mistake. Make sure that your instrument set is Garrett instruments for finale. So again, single strings. Make sure you select Violin Solo KS1, Violin Solo KS2, Viola, and Cello Solo. So you see, I only have to double click that name. I don't have to select it and then press Add. It will show up here. I say Finish, and it will add those staves to my score. The next thing I want to do is copy all the music from here into the new staves. So they're going to play back. Press Escape Escape to get to the selection tool. And now click in an empty space to the left of the violin one staff. For example here. Hold Shift and do the same here next to the cello staff. And that will select all your music. The easiest way to copy the music into the new staves is by option clicking the first bar of the new violin part. Before you do this, make sure the filter is not active. So uncheck that and then hold option and click the first bar of the violin one. Boom, all the music goes where it should be. The next step is to erase the old staves that didn't play back. Delete stays and reposition. So play this. Beautiful. Everything works. The next step would be to go back to Studio View, Shift Command E, or you might just want to select it from the View menu right here. We need to solo the violin one, so we're not exporting any of the other parts. Now, I assume that you checked your music for mistakes at this point, that you put all the dynamics in, all the articulations, and all the slurs, etc. And you're ready to go. Go to the File menu and export to Audio File. Call this Violin 1. And I create a new folder on my desktop called Strings. I save this. Finale will be busy for a little bit. See, it's doing some stuff. It says here playing. No, it's still busy. It's calculating. And that should be it. So if I go to my finder, open up finder window, go to the strings folder, here is my audio. So technically it should play back. Here we go. Now you have to do this with all the other parts.